What's happening YouTube family? Soil King here. I'm um, coming at you this morning. We're going to check out an RO system. We're going to see what the chlorine available and total chlorines going in and coming out are to see if it's actually working and how good it's working. This uh, is a fairly inexpensive model right here. Uh, we sell all the way up to really elaborate ones. But uh, this one I'm going to go ahead and we're going to run testing on it. And you'll, we're going to check the water coming in. And we're going to check the water coming out for the chlorine level. So give me a second. I'm going to run into the shop and I'll see you. Okay, so here we are. We're coming. We're in the shop. We're going to check. Um, we're going to check free residual and total chlorine levels. I got a meter right here. This is what I like to use. A little elaborate and expensive, but this is what I like to do to get it right. So first, this is the... Uh, Straight before the RO system, this is after. I'm just going to pour some water in here. See if I don't make too big of a mess. Got to fill this all the way up. And what we do is we balance it out. We check for a zero read. It kind of it's all it's all ran by light over here. So I put the power on. I'll zero it out. You can watch the dial, it's counting down. Then we're going to read it. Hit the read button right there. Actually, my bad, I got to zero it out again. I got to start over. I got to dump half of it out. Well, you know, even Soil King makes mistakes, right? So, we're going to shut it off and do it one more time. Shut it off. We're going to turn it on. We're going to zero it out. Does a countdown. It's all transmitted through light. It's a pretty, pretty cool little mechanism right here. So, we got zero. So, now what I'm going to do is i got to pour half of this off to go to the halfway mark. I'm going to add my free residual pack right here. Like you kind of see if it turns pink, which it kind of looks like it's, I don't know if you can really see that tint of pink, so you know there's chlorine in it. So I'm going to shake it up good. Now you can see the pinkness to it. Now it's already been zeroed out, so now it's going to read the uh, free residual chlorine levels in it. We're going to read that, have a countdown. Point three seven. Okay, so there, there's our levels for re, uh, free residual chlorines in as of right now. So let's uh, just, we'll do the same process. But we're going to do it after it came out. Let me fill this clean vial up. Fill it up all the way. I like to turn this off and then restart it. Put a slide it in there. Zero it out. Pour half of it off. Add a little more magic sauce in here. Shake it up. So you can already see the pink's gone. So the carbon filters have worked. I can see just from the eye, but we're gonna go ahead and see how well it worked. Put it in here and we're gonna read it. So this one is uh, after it's coming out of the RO system. Point zero 0.01, see that's really good. So we know as of this test right now, it is working. 
and um, then we could do the same thing with a uh, total. You don't need to watch that process, but uh, you get the idea of it. And you know, here we are. So we know our reverse osmosis system did work and it's not gonna affect our microbial development on our soil. So, you know, that's a thumbs up, Soil King approved right there. Now, pressure coming out the other end, you always gotta look for pressure. The more pressure going through an RO system, it pushes at a higher rate and sometimes you can lose um, a lot of the cleanliness and you'll end up with residuals of chlorine as well. So anyways, have a good day. Enjoy your weekend. Today is Valentine's Day. Happy Valentine's Day to my wife, all my fans out there and friends and loved ones and mom. <laughs>